So you've disabled app tracking. You've disabled access to your camera, to your mic. You've limited the access to your photos, to a lot of the different apps that you have on your phone, like the meta apps, you know, Facebook and Instagram, but yet you still feel like you're being tracked. You're right, you're still being tracked. Turning off those settings doesn't make you invisible. It just lessens the amount of information that you're sharing with them. Facebook and Instagram still collect data, and this is how they do it, in-app activity. So anything you do within their services, when you access Facebook, when you access Instagram, whether you scroll past a post, whether you stay and read a post for however many seconds, those pictures you upload, they collect data from your friends. So if your friend syncs their contacts, Meta gets your phone number. If your friend uploads a photo of you, Meta can recognize your face, even if you're not tagged. Oh, and those conversations you're having in your Instagram DMs, those are not necessarily encrypted, which means they can essentially access those conversations. And it's mostly gonna be accessed probably through their Meta AI in order to train it. This is all part of their terms of service. You've agreed to this. But here are other creepy ways that you may not know on how they collect information on you. They can actually track you across the internet. Even if you've turned off app tracking on your phone, there are websites where Meta has given them what's called a Meta Pixel. So on about 30% of the world's top websites, and a lot of them are e-commerce websites where you shop, they can see what you search, what you buy, what you click on, how often you visit. They can get all that information from that tracker. They buy data from other businesses. So stores, even offline stores, actually share your purchases. And those loyalty programs, they can send them a lot of information on you. They analyze it all with AI. Every click, every link, it helps them predict what ad to show you next. So even if you're careful with your settings, they can still build a profile on you. You don't even have to give them your information. Your friends already did. You're not crazy. You're being watched even when you say no. Do me a favor, send this to that friend that shares way too much on Facebook.